certainly when we looked at, at coming to the school, there's always pressures around how quickly you enter first grade, what your anticipated progress is going to be through the school. And both my son and daughter were encouraged not to move forward to first grade in a hurry. The focus on doing things in an age-appropriate way, of not rushing childhood, not rushing learning, in, uh, learning to read, that is, not rushing uh, all the homework-orientated activities, all the busyness that really fills up so many students' and, and young children's lives, uh, was really important to us. And they were able to stay in the kindergarten uh, environment for another year. They entered the, the first grade at a really good place for them. I think they were physically ready for it. Uh, when they started doing homework, they were physically ready for it. And all the activities that, asso that were associated with those early years really were um, appropriate to them at the stage that they were in. We weren't pushing them into things that they weren't ready for. The connections with uh, nature, with the nature trail, with gardening, with activities outside, because they played outside every day, no matter what the weather you know, was, uh, was just phenomenal. And I think that left them with such a, uh, such a ready... Um, a readiness to learn when they did come to learn, you know, the, the learning to read, the learning to count, the learning of the alphabet, all those things that, that occurred at a much more age-appropriate um, point in their lives uh, was great. You know, it, it, it felt for us that we weren't rushing through childhood. We weren't trying to make them into little students, uh, little teenagers before they were ready for it. And they've been able to jump forward at the times when, when they needed to progress, when they, when they were physically ready to do things that, that were then appropriate to them. They've had no trouble picking things up. So, you know, they've not had trouble learning to read. They've not had trouble learning to do other things. And when you look at the class that graduated now with the number of different colleges and, and things that they're going to, they clearly haven't suffered any by starting some of those things late. So there's no rush to get into reading. There's no rush to get into any of the things that seem important when you're a teenager or, or a young adult. They're not important when you're a young child.